Yeah, I just started in my practice. Um, I'm a practicing dentist. Um, I graduated from USC in 2000. I opened my practice in Santa Clarita in 2002. And I opened a second practice also in the Santa Clarita area um, in 2007, I want to say. Um, both practices were digital. I love technology. I always envisioned um, a, a paperless office, not necessarily because I'm a, a, a self, a, you know, a, a tree hugger, which, you know, of course I care about the environment, but that wasn't the main goal. The main goal was to be efficient. Uh, working in a dental practice for uh, a number of years, a busy dental practice and here in Southern California where I'm located, um, we have quite a, a busy volume of, of patients and, and uh, um, one of my practices is, is fairly large. We pretty much do everything in-house. Um, and my other practice was a smaller boutique practice, but the challenge was the same. We had great practice management software um, that was supposed to help us be uh, paperless, but what we found is that we weren't paperless, we were chartless. And the difference is, Chartless describes how the information is stored. So everything, we don't have paper charts, everything is in the practice management software. We can put it in to the practice management software. We can retrieve information from practice management software. Uh, but the process is still manual. In fact, it's like doing double work from what we've had with charts because now we printed uh, paper forms, we handed them to patients, patients filled them out. And the team who at the front, who was juggling multiple things at the same time, had to uh, retype that information while answering phones, while greeting other patients, very um, error prone system. Um, and then they would shred the paper, then they would print the routing slip, then they would take a yellow highlighter and highlight all of the actionable items, which in my mind, I was like, software should deliver the actionable information at our fingertips. We shouldn't have to search for it because it's always the same information. We realize that we can really streamline operations in the front um, and the back of a dental practice by, um, by creating a software that does more than just store information. So this is where the idea came. Um, communication was always a challenge in dental practice because you know, the dentist and the hygienist are always in the mouth, right? And the front office is on the phone and doing other things and the assistant is running around the office. Communicating is a challenge because we're never in the same room. As a result, we built a software that was designed for my practices. And what we did that, we had such a success. We ran with it. It's been an amazing, amazing ride just coming up with solutions that would essentially help me in my practice. And by virtue of doing this, it, it helps others. Patients are impressed with technology, but they're also impressed with the high touch that we're able to offer because we're not constantly doing the busy work. We're releasing a, a patient portal uh, fairly soon. That's what we're working on right now. Um, the patient portal will allow um, patients to update their paperwork, their digital paperwork online. It will allow them to take care of unpaid balances. It would allow them to schedule appointments. Um, it would allow them to sign any consent forms, look at their outstanding treatment plans, connect us to their pharmacy if they need a prescription. Um, I think that's gonna be really critical. Um, and, and you know, one thing that we've learned is that when we couldn't be in our offices to take care of patients and patients were calling us, um, having technology, having access to digital, um, you know, charts and, and patient information and being able to communicate with them without using our own personal cell phones, that was very critical. But what we also learned is that even when we're back in full swing, um, there are a lot of things that we sometimes need to handle when we are not in the office, whether because we are not in the office for life work balance, we, you know, maybe we need to take off a little early to uh, make the recital with, with our kids. And then we want to catch up on some, um, you know, post post operative uh, calls to patients, just some care calls to patients to make sure that they're doing well after the, the day's treatment, or maybe we have some cancellations. Uh, over the weekend and we need to fill the schedule quickly, or maybe we have an emergency patient who's calling us and we need to make sure that it's the right patient and we have access to their information so we can prescribe, maybe even have a face-to-face. -face. I mean, that type of technology is really becoming critical. We're reinventing our core software to make it even better and easier and faster, but we are also adding a lot of features that would allow 
um, you know, maybe flexible work schedules and, and, and easier lifestyle for, for dentists and their teams.